everyone. We're so excited to be back on the couch with a new book that we know you're going to love. Let me take a quick second to introduce you to the lovely Emily Freeman. Emily, <laughs> say hello to hello. your readers. Hello. Um, <laughs> we often get the chance to sit down and talk with people who we're dear friends with in real life, and that is the case with this one, and it just makes it such a blast for us, and you guys are going to feel like you're sitting here with us. So mm -hmm. just as an introduction, we wanted to let Emily tell us a little bit about the book, but before we do that, do you want to do that before? Sure. I think it would Why help. <laughs> I think it would help to do it that way so that they have like kind of an idea of what's coming up and yeah. then we'll sort of finish out with Emily. So if you're new to Bloom, um, how this is going to work is every week we're going to go through about three chapters a week and we're going to be sitting with Emily and we're going to just talk through the chapters just as if you were here sitting right in my living room um, doing book club with us. And so we hope that you'll join us and you can watch the videos at your own pace and join us in the comments. Robin Dance hosts all of the blog posts and all of the comments and really keeps the community going. It's just a, it's a neat process mm -hmm. to see. So um, we're excited to have Emily here and hope that you guys will stick around for the length of the study. Yeah, and this one in particular, I think, and you'll tell us a little bit about it in a second, mm -hmm. but I think this one in particular is a great study to, because I know in mine, I have a lot of places where I have like a question mark, like ask Emily more about this. And oh. so what I'm hoping is gonna happen, and they're mostly biblical trivia facts. I thought they so might be. I hope you're ready for that. Right. Um, <laughs> but what I love is that it leads to a further dialogue that might not be in this book. Right. And so I hope that people, when they're watching these, I have a feeling they're going to be able to, to see some of the some of the stories and some of the behind the scenes that aren't necessarily mm -hmm. talked about in here. I hope yeah. that we'll bring some of that out. So I hope so too. I think it's going to be an awesome study. But just as a kind of like, hey, this is what the book is about, how do you describe it to people? Because it is really a different concept. Yeah, this book has been hard to describe. In fact, when I first started writing it mm -hmm. um, and people would be like, so what's your book about? I would be like, well, and that's when you know, like you're not ready yet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> describe maybe, it like maybe, this. Yeah. Yeah. Right. And so, but one time I was, I had, the book had been written and I had, it was sort of in the editing process mm -hmm. and I was at a women's conference and I, they were sort of asking me like you guys at the end of the mm -hmm. conference, they were like, so tell us about your next book. Like, what's it about? And what came out of my mouth, and I'm so glad mm. it did, was, well, this book is really for, for the person who desperately fears they have nothing to offer, mm. but secretly hopes they're wrong. Yeah. Oh, and the women so in the good, audience Emily. went, oh. yeah. And then I yeah. saw women go like this. It's every, like, yeah. <laughs> and I was yeah. like, oh. <laughs> that, I'm, I'm like, write that down. I've got to remember it's it's good. Because I thought, oh, okay, that's kind of what it is. Because I right? really believe mm. that we all do have something to offer, and mm. it might not look like what you have or right. what you have, but it's what you have. Mm -hmm. And so I really I like believe that, that there's yeah. something that, that, that a lot of us are missing. That mm -hmm. we feel like, and it's not something that we have to go out and find. That's what right? I love but about it. it's something that's been put mm -hmm. within us by a creative yeah. God. So mm -hmm. that's what I, I hope that as we talk, that that uh -huh. is what comes out. I think it will. Yeah, Tell everybody too. if they aren't familiar with your blog or oh, yeah. who you are, just a little bit about you too. Oh, just so a little backstory. Story. <laughs> no, so I have been blogging for about, it's been eight years I was going to say way longer than most it's people have It's been almost been. eight years, which is crazy. Um, so I blog at Chatting at the Sky. Mm -hmm. um, so and beautiful. It, you take beautiful pictures. Mm -hmm. I love to take pictures. Thank you for saying they're beautiful. Um, but yeah, I did I did pictures for a while, like thinking like maybe this is what I'm supposed to do mm -hmm. is take right. pictures. But I realized like, no, like this just, it just makes me come mm -hmm. alive. And it right. just helps me see the world. That's but awesome. it's not for any useful thing. It's just because mm -hmm. I love to do it. So, um, so yeah, I'm married to my husband, John. I have a husband for, let's see, we've been married for 12 years. Yeah, now, maybe? exactly. I remember we yeah. talked about that. With twin kiddos. girls. Yeah. We've got a very, a very yeah. similar twin girls and then our, a son. And so they're okay. elementary school age. So yeah, that's so awesome. And you're just really enjoyable to be with. I mean that so sincerely. I like, love when people say that. When it's so true though. Like when we just <laughs> sat down and had coffee and talked about the mm -hmm. book, what I love and what I think will happen here is that we start by talking about text and it turns into just flesh like a life like where are you in mm -hmm. and I think that that is really going to translate here yeah. so I hope that you all will join us for this I think you're going to get a lot out of it mm -hmm. do it at your own pace and I'm just going to add this as a little caveat at the beginning because if I had seen this and I hadn't known you mm -hmm. I probably would not have bought it and I'll right. tell you why tell me why I do not consider myself an artist mm -hmm. at all mm -hmm. and I don't mm -hmm. want people to be intimidated by the language yeah, if they're right. considering doing this study, it is for you. We know very well who yep. watches these, and mm -hmm. we try to choose books that we think will resonate. This is one I know will. Yep. So if you have to skip the back cover and just take our <laughs> word for it, please do that. Yeah. Don't think that this isn't you, because it really is, and we're excited to dig in with you. So, so join us next week. Yeah. See you then. See ya.